and I were looking at me, looking up at the picture, and then looking at me again, and she finally came over and asked me for my autograph. And I said, well, do you know who I am? And she said, yeah, you used to be Pat McCurry. <laughs> Well, you're laughing, but I have never heard that before. <laughs> and all of a sudden I began to think of, boy, I, I think it's great to have a lot of used to be. All of you sitting out there graduating used to be in school, and I'm sure you'll go back, but this period of your life, you're going to charge with the rest of your life. I'd like just to pause one moment and pay tribute to all our men and women. And I, oh, I was right, I'm sorry and the veterans, because if they were doing what they're doing, we wouldn't be here today. And, uh, <laughs> I'm trying to get better at this part, because I have a therapy dog, and we're going to be going back to Washington. I would love to have brought him, but he's still a puppy. He want to play. But I know every time I see a veteran, I get teary up. I gotta be tough. But talking about tough, the 1948, I'm going to give you a few minutes. I missed the first Olympic team by one one hundredth of a point. And I'm sure you all can uh, reminisce with me things that you've worked so hard for, and people tell you you can't do it. I remember sitting in the showers crying, and uh, all of a sudden I started thinking, wait a minute, I almost made that Olympic team. I know I could win. I know I could win. The next Olympics was going to be in Helsinki, Finland. And then I got this impossible, I dared to dream. I could see it. I wanted to go to the back-to-back -back Olympics and win four gold medals. It was so ridiculous that I couldn't tell anybody, especially at that age. But you know what? John Wood, one of our greatest basketball coaches, and such a great man, I heard him one day and he said, Pat, Imagination is the capacity to see what is already there. Yep, that's what it's all about. I got up the next day while everybody sailed off to London and I started training. 100 times a day, six days a week, 12 months a year. And I'm sure you all can relate to that. There are no secrets. You just got to work at it. Um, 